Dear students, in this topic, we shall discuss the features of absorptive epithelium of small intestine. Absorption is a phenomena through which the digested nutrients present in the lumen of the alimentary canal are absorbed into the blood to be transported and to reach the tissues and cells of the body. Most of the absorption occurs by crossing the epithelial lining of the ileum part of small intestine. The epithelial lining of the small intestine and especially of the ileum part is specialized for absorptive functions. This epithelial lining has increased surface area for absorption and has a rich supply of transport system. These two features make it a specialized surface for absorption of products of digestion. First, we shall discuss the adaptations of small intestine to increase the surface area for absorption. The surface area for absorption is increased by the evolution and development of certain anatomical features. For example, intestinal folds, villi, epithelial cells on villi, and microvilli. We shall discuss these features one by one. The intestinal folds. If we see the luminal wall of small intestine, it has numerous circular folds. These folds provide increased surface for the placement of villi, which substantially increase the surface area for absorption. Villi are finger-like projections, which are present in thousands numbers on the circular folds. Her villus jo hai, ye ek small structure hai, jiski length takriban ek millimeter ki hoti hai, aur in ki presence ki vajah se, intestine ki andar ki surface ki appearance velvety ho jati hai. Hum agar intestine ko open kare, aur us surface ko dekhe, to that appears velvety. That is because of the presence of villi on it. The each villus has a covering of epithelial cells. These epithelial cells form the actual absorptive surface of small intestine. Jo bhi substances absorb hote hain, wo actually in epithelial cells may absorb hote hain. The microvilli. Many thousand closely packed cylindrical processes are present on the apical surface of each epithelial cell. Epithelial cell ki membrane smooth nahi hai. Balke is ki ek side, jo luminal side hai, jaha par intestinal lumen ko face karta hai epithelial cell, us surface ke upar hazaron ki tadad mein microvilli mojood hote hain. Each microvillus is about 0.5 to 1.5 micrometer long and is about 0.1 micrometer wide. Yeh joh structures hain, yeh har epithelial cell ki absorptive surface ko thousands times increase karte hain. Dear students, ये जो microvilli हैं, इनकी इतनी बड़ी तादाद जब side by side ले करती है, 
तो इंटेस्टाइनल एपिथीलियम की अपियरेंस ब्रश लाइक हो जाती है यही वजह है कि एक स्पेशल टर्म इस्तेमाल होती है इंटेस्टाइनल लाइनिंग के लिए दैट इज ब्रश बॉर्डर दैट इज बिकॉज ऑफ द प्रेजेंस ऑफ माइक्रोविलाई माइक्रोविलाई इंक्रीज द टोटल कैपेसिटी फॉर न्यूट्रिय एब्जॉर्बन डे स्टूडेंट्स नाउ वी शैल डिस्कस द supply of transport system to the villi and to the uh, small intestine a villus has a network of blood vessels inside it these blood vessels consist of arterioles capillaries and venules in ka pura network ek villus ke center mein maujood hota hai iske ilawa ek villus jo hai उसके अंदर लिम्फ वेसल्स का भी एक नेटवर्क मौजूद होता है और इन लिम्फेटिक वेसल्स में सबसे बड़ी जो है वो एक सेंट्रल लेक्टियल है जो कि हर विलाई को सप्लाई की जाती है न्यूट्रिएंट्स विच आर टेकन अप बाय द एपिथेलियल सेल्स आर ट्रांसफर टू ब्लड एंड लिम्फ वेसल्स इनसाइड साइड द विलाई सेंट्रल लेक्टियल कैन टेक अप कंपेरेटिवली लार्जर पार्टिकल्स as compared to the blood circulatory capillaries dear students overall the intestinal epithelium which has intestinal folds villi and microvilli they collectively increase the surface area more than 500 times total area for absorption of the small intestine in humans is about 200 to 300 meter squares jabke agar hum small intestine ka as such cylindrical area dekhe to that is only 0.4 meter squares is tarah se ye ek substantial increase hai jo ke takriban 500 times banti hai 